There are a great many natural remedies for yeast infection out there. The good news is you don't have to try every natural remedy. There is there are people who do that for you. Some of those people tried using white vinegar to cure yeast infection, and this video is about whether this is a genuine cure or just more hooey. First, I highly recommend you to stop spending so much money on yeast infection treatment products that do not work. Use that money and invest in your knowledge about yeast infection instead. If you don't know where to start, I recommend you to pick up the ebook Yeast Infection No More written by Linda Allen. I have used his unique five step method to help me cure my yeast infection in as little as 12 hours. So I'm just going to cut to the chase. Is white vinegar one of the many natural remedies for yeast infection? The answer is a partial yes, but I definitely don't recommend trying it. All the white vinegar does is suppress the yeast infection and not cure it. The increase in the number of the fungus can be due to several circumstances. It is observed that the growth of candida increases in a more acidic environment. Maintaining a good balance of acidity and alkalinity in the body is vital in limiting the growth of this fungus. The human body has a normal pH range between 7.35 and 7.45. Even the smallest changes in the human body's pH level can cause serious health complications like the occurrence of yeast infection. White vinegar which has a pH of 5.5 is understandably very acidic and therefore not helpful in arresting the candida yeast infection. The only type of vinegar which is helpful in treating this disease is apple cider which has a pH of 7.5. Finally, good diet is one key to arrest the presence of yeast infection and white vinegar should not be a part of it. The replacement of foods with supplements that are alkaline is highly recommended. White vinegar can actually feed the infection rather than stop it.